Hello everyone. Hope you're doing well. So today we learn our first chapter of class 9th geography and the name of the chapter is India size and location. What's the name of the chapter? It's India size and location. So basically what we learn in this chapter. So we learn about India. So we'll what we learn about what we learn about india so we learn about the size of india and its location okay we learn about what we learn about india's size and its location got it okay so so now we we'll start with introduction okay so see recall some basics of previous classes so we'll recall some basics of our previous classes okay and uh, and you know what are these basics these basics are that what are latitude what is latitude what is longitude what is equator and what is hemisphere okay so uh, you know that there are two more important latitudes and what are these latitudes these latitudes are tropic of cancer and tropic of Capricorn got it Okay so let's understand some basics okay so in basics we we'll, today we will study about equator so we will learn about equator by its definition okay so what is equator equator is an imaginary line that divides the earth into two equal half that divides the earth into two into two equal half Yes. Okay. So let me show you an image through which we can understand clearly. So see, this is an image of Earth. Okay. So the equator is dividing the Earth into two equal half, and the equator is at zero degree. Yes, the equator is at zero degree. So the equator is dividing the Earth into two equal half. So the upper part is known as Northern Hemisphere and the lower part is known as Southern Hemisphere. So the upper part is known as what? Northern Hemisphere. The lower part is known as what? Southern Hemisphere. Okay, so let me show you an an other image through which we can understand more clearly. Okay, so see, this is what? This is what? This is the image of Earth. Okay, so uh, the equator is dividing the earth into two equal half okay so the upper part is known as what northern hemisphere and the lower part is known as what southern hemisphere got it or not okay so i hope you got it about equator that what is equator okay so uh, now let's move on to latitude okay so i i'm going i'm going to explain latitude by this picture okay so so see this is equator on zero degree okay so this is the equator on zero degree we have we know and the equator divides the earth into two equal half okay and this equator runs from west to east and you know that all the parallel lines of the equator are known as latitude and you know and you know that these latitudes are run in these latitudes are also running from west to east okay and see these lines are what these lines are horizontal got it these lines are what these lines are horizontal and you know that when we move from zero degree equator towards the north pole the all the all these latitudes will start reducing one by one got it and you know i'm going to tell you one more thing you just suppose that you are standing on zero degree equator okay and after some time you are standing on one degree latitude so do you know that what is the distance between Zero degree, zero degree equator and one degree latitude. Don't know. No problem. I'll tell you. So see, the distance between zero degree equator and one degree 
latitude is about 111 kilometer. You must know this because it may come in your exams. Okay. So see, I hope you got it all. Okay, so there are some more important there are some more important and special latitudes. Okay, so what are these latitudes? These latitudes are Tropic of Cancer and Tropic of Capricorn. Okay, so now I'm going to tell uh, explain Tropic of Cancer and Tropic of Capricorn through a image. Okay, so see, just wait for two minutes. See, now uh, this is just suppose this uh, now we are going to understand all it. Okay. So just uh, we ha I have told you that what is equator? Equator divides the earth into two equal half. Okay, so so just suppose. Uh, okay, so see uh, when we are when we start moving from zero degree equator towards the north pole, we will found a what? We will found a latitude at twenty three point five degree north. Okay, and this latitude will be known as tropic of cancer this is not that disease of cancer okay this is just what this is the name of a latitude okay so we'll found, find a latitude at 23 and half degree north and this is this latitude is known as tropic of cancer got it okay so now when we'll move from Zero degree equator towards the south pole. We found another. We found another latitude. Okay, so that latitude will be also at twenty three and f half degree south. Okay, and this latitude will be tropic of Capricorn. This latitude will be of what? This is tropic of Capricorn. Yes, you heard right. Okay. So now the now the region between Tropic of Capricorn and Tropic of Cancer is what? Do you know what is the region between Tropic of Cancer and Tropic of Capricorn? Don't know. I'll tell you. So see, the region between Tropic of Cancer and Tropic of Capricorn is it is known it is known as what? Do you know? No problem. I'll tell you. So it's known as tropical zone okay or we can say torrid zone okay so and you know who is that it um, it uh, it receives maximum sunlight okay it receives the maximum sunlight that's the reason why at this at this region there is too hot because the sun the rays of the sun comes directly at this region so there is too 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 hot over there got it okay i hope you got it better about tropical zone okay so now uh, now i'm gonna tell you about subtropical zone okay so see what is subtropical zone it's just like tropical zone and how it's like tropical zone let me tell you so see uh, we know that the the region between Tropic of Cancer and Tropic of Capricorn is known as Tropical Zone. Just like that, the region between Tropic of Cancer and Arctic Circle is known as Subtropical or we can say Temperate Zone. Okay? And you know that there are two subtropical zones. Okay? First is of Northern Hemisphere and second is of Southern Hemisphere, and you know that this subtropical zone is neither too much hot nor too much cold. And if you know, so please, please, so please comment in the comment box, okay? Okay, so now see, uh, I hope you understood all this, okay? So now, so see, uh, in this lecture, we have studied about. Uh, equator, hemisphere, and latitude, uh, and latitude, topic of Cancer, and topic of Capricorn. Okay, so in my next lecture, we will study about in about longitude and India's location. Okay, so uh, if you are liking my video, so please, please, please like, share, and subscribe my video. Bye bye.